So this is where you'd sign up for a free trial. If you decide after this call that uh, you'd love to get in there and kick the tires, by all means, please do so. We certainly um, give you 14 days to experience the full platform. So I'm going to dive into my account here. So um, now, uh, although your free trial will look a little different, of course, you would have um, no sequences. Oh, actually, I put some, never mind. <laughs> Either way, you won't have these here, but this is the main dashboard uh, and you would start your first sequence here. But before we even dive into sequencing, I want to just address how we operate. So unlike marketing automation, where they're blasting out 10,000 newsletters a day or things like that from their server, in a platform like this, we are connecting directly to the email accounts or mailboxes that you connect. So it is important that uh, you consider whether you want to use your primary domain or multiple domains. Either way, it is um, crucial that you mimic natural human behavior as much as possible when using a platform like Reply. So the safest way to scale is certainly to add additional mailboxes as opposed to increasing the volume on one particular mailbox. Um, we do recommend that you do not exceed 200 emails a day per mailbox, uh, but I believe we'll let you go up to 400 if that hasn't changed. <laughs> I apologize. Um, but yeah, recommendation would be 200. Once you've connected your email, there's a lot of things that we do uh, as a system, but then also as a staff. Um, we will automatically check your DNS settings, ensure that everything's been optimized for deliverability, protect the domain long term. So if you do get red lights here, we can assist you with resolving those things. You also want to possibly set up a ramp up period. So we do offer warm up services, uh, protection mode. But even if your domain and your email accounts are really well seasoned and ready to go, um, I would not ex uh, I would certainly not recommend any sudden spikes of activity. So if your habitual behavior is about 30 emails a day or you've warmed up to 50, you don't want to just suddenly spike to 200 particularly if it's all the same content and initially all one-way communication. None of that is natural. So you do want to tell our system, hey, start me at 30 or 50, whatever you're comfortable with, and then increase in increments of five or 10 until I reach my desired maximum. That way you don't need to manage that. The system will take care of all that for you. Um, putting your signature separately from the sequencing is a good idea as well, just so that uh, if you do have nice images, logos, graphics, uh, they are... Uh, kind of, they're going to fly under the radar and be seen as part of the V card. And then, of course, opt out text is critical as well to be compliant with can spam. If these are cold, unsolicited emails, you should have some form of opt out, uh, either an unsubscribe link uh, or even just plain text, letting them know that you'll respect their privacy. Okay, at any point, anyone responding to the email is removed and marked finished, replied. Uh, but again, to be compliant, it is a good idea to have something there.